Welcome, it's time to talk mortgages with Academy Mortgage, and I am here with Kelly today. And Kelly, it's great to see you. Oh my gosh, it's so good to see you. Good to be back. Yes. It's been a minute. It has been a minute. And you know, I think today, why don't we just sort of have, let's have a real talk conversation <laughs> about, about the market. And you know, people, let's just be honest, are maybe a little hesitant to, to purchase a new home, but what is always, you can always fall back on is history. So what can you tell us about sort of the history of the housing market to maybe give people a little more confidence? Listen, I completely um, agree with you. It's time for real talk, real story. <laughs> um, and you know, consumer confidence is down, you know, just based on everything that's going on in our economy, you know, the political environment. Um, and I think there's a lot of uncertainty with consumers. And I have to tell you, I mean, do you kind of feel it? Oh, absolutely. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I do too. You know, it's funny, my husband and I are empty nesters now and we sold our home in January of this year and we've been looking for a home. And it crossed our minds to go like, hey, should we just rent for a minute and just kind of see where this market's going? And being a history buff. Right, when I, you actually yeah. look into that, yes. what do the numbers say? Yes. So. You know, I looked at the last 45 years, should you invest in real estate and what's the return on real estate versus the stock market? And so over the last 45 years, as Yahoo states, 11.53% return in the stock market, which is really super good. Um, but what's less impressive is the volatility, right? So if you look at housing according to Forbes, over the last 150 years, housing has had a 7.05% return. So real estate has proven over the last 145 years to still be the most stable way to build wealth for our families. Well, Kelly, I'm sure there's some people out there that would love to start a conversation about this exact thing. So what is the best way to get in touch? Well, give us a call or visit us on our website. We would love to serve you and your family to build wealth and own what matters.